Welcome back, guys. It's Vengeance Hero, and you're joining me for Final Fantasy VI or three, if you're in North America. Um, this is the uh, FF6 Pixel Remaster, and uh, I'm actually going to skip through here. Um. Interesting. Okay, not sure. I don't really hear the difference. Uh, I'm playing on control as I feel like it was meant to be played. Um, I did start the game um, just to get my recording settings down, and uh, while I was doing that, I was playing by mouse, and it was actually kind of terrible. Um, yeah. Not much else going on here. The ancient war of the Magi, when its flames at last receded, only the charred husk of a world remained. Even the power of magic was lost. In the thousand years that followed, iron, gunpowder, and steam engines took the place of magic and life slowly returned to the bare land. Yet there now stands one who would reawaken the magic of ages past and use its dread power as a means by which to conquer all the world. Could anyone truly be foolish enough to repeat that mistake? Well, obviously. There's the city. Hard to believe an esper has been found frozen there a thousand years after the War of the Magi. Ah, probably just another wild goose chase. I don't know. They wouldn't have let us use her unless they were confident the intel was cool. Ah yes, our witch. I hear she fried 50 of her Magitech armor soldiers. Three minutes kind of makes you for all, doesn't it? Relax with that thing on her head. She's a mindless puppet. The girl won't even breathe unless we tell her to. We'll approach from the east. Move out. <coughs> so you can skip, but probably is skipping like the entire scene, not just parts of the dialogue. So we're not gonna do that. Man, so fucking good.
so good. It's kind of crazy, like, how much you remember. Like, it's probably been, um... Oh, gosh. I definitely didn't play this when it first came out. Um... I ended up buying a copy of this game used on Super Nintendo. The girl takes point and don't waste time on the riffraff. Remember what we're here for. Let's move. Okay, so I'm pretty sure I can just press. I'm just going to quickly have a look here. Uh, when Final Fantasy 3 slash 6 came out out uh, I guess it it's more six I guess as far as we're concerned oh my god it's impossible to tell because like there's um Final Fantasy 3 and Final Fantasy 6. So there's a little bit of discrepancy in dates. <clears throat> Let me see if I can find this. Is this actually Final Fantasy 3? No. Okay, so in Japan it looks like this came out in Which is crazy to me. 1990? Is that legit? Okay, well, if it is 1990, then I definitely didn't play it when it first came out. Then that's... No, that can't be. That must be Famicom. Because... Like, that's... That's... I feel like that's, what, six... Eight years, maybe, from when the NES came out. So, like, Super NES would have been brand new, and I don't think this was anywhere near a launch title. Um, yeah. I th think... Yeah, even Google's just basically, like, Pixel Remaster and... Oh, okay, here we go. 1994 is the Super NES release. So, 94, I would have been 10 years old. I probably did not play it when I was 10. Um, but probably close after. I remember paying... Uh, so, I went to a video game trader in Calgary, and I ended up buying... Basically, it was a complete in-box version. And it was like 80 bucks. And at the time, 80 bucks was a lot of money for a used game. I mean, even brand new stuff wasn't $80 back then. Um, so I'm guessing that's probably like... Uh, 90... I'm going to say 95, 96. So it's probably been that long since I played this game. So, but it... Anyways, I went off on a fucking crazy tangent, but bottom line is, um, I was going to say it's amazing how much you remember about a game, even though you haven't played it for, like, 20 plus years. So, anyways, uh, we are going to jump right in. I'm hoping that I got my recording settings all down pat. The Empire's got no business here. Yeah, like, playing this on mouse and keyboard is awful. Like, having to, like, drag the mouse down to the corner, click your Magitech button, and then click on the enemy that you want to attack. It's fucking terrible. But... Much better playing on controller. Very happy about that. Oh 
Okay. Stop them, Bernarsh. In the mines. These guys. According to our source, some miners unearthed a frozen Esper in a new shaft they were digging. This must be it. Save point, fuck it, we don't care. We don't need it. We don't need it at all. A handle this. Stand back! Hug! <laughs> Oh fuck! We're not handing over the Esper. Ymir, get him. Oh. Hold it. This thing's a. Uh, they must have trained it to guard the mines. What are you talking about? You know what this is? Ever heard of a lightning well? It's a monster that absorbs lightning and stores the energy in its shell. Right. Whatever you do, don't attack the shell. Got it. Okay, so this battle, we definitely are going to hold off attacking um, to some extent. We want to make sure we're not attacking when it's in the shell. Ooh! Fuck is a grok. I wonder if it defaults to the person with the lowest health percentage. No, must not. Just goes to the very top, I guess. Come 
come out of your fucking shell, bro. Dead? Nope. Oh man, she is so fucking slow. Are you dead? Nope. Give me a fucking missile. Slime must be slowing. the Esper. So, this is the frozen Esper. This thing's giving me the creeps. Something's not right. The frozen creature begins emitting an eerie light. Where's that light coming from? Wow! Oh, fuck! What was that, Wedge? Wedge, where are you? Hey, what's going on? Fucking owned. Narsh. Oh, hello. Where am I? My, my, and I only just removed the crown. My head hurts. Easy there. This is a slave crown. The others were using it to control you. It was robbing you of your thoughts, making it so you'd do whatever they told you. I can't remember a thing. Don't worry, it'll all come back to you in time, that is. A mysterious young woman, born with a gift of magic and enslaved by the Castalian Empire. Terra, of course. Weird that I still have to use a keyboard for some shit. My name is Terra. Impressive. I've never heard of anyone recovering so fast. You must be made of tougher stuff than most. Open up! We're here for the Magitek armor pilot. Okay, so these are the actual Narsh guards. Open this door right now. Hand over that girl. She's an agent of the Empire. Empire? Magitek armor? There's no time to explain. You need to get out of here. These fools aren't going to listen to reason. This way, quickly. Bye. See you later, motherfuckers. Up there. You can't catch me. Fuck off. Harsh mines. Three up. Up. Oh. Spritzer. Ooh. Gotcha, bitch. No 
I don't care about save points. Okay. Why do you have so much fucking help, bro? Attack? What the fuck? It is definitely a little bit boring when you have only one character and you're waiting for your fucking attack bar to fill up. There she is. Oh fuck! Uh. <sighs> Boom. My sweet little magic user. Wee hee hee. Kefka. With this slave crown, you'll be all mine. Hooray! It's crazy how bad the graphics are. And then you look at, like, the art from the instruction manual and it's fucking so prime. It's so good. A wee hee hee. Good, good. Burn them all to a crisp. Soldiers of the Empire, we stand at the dawn of a new age. The lost power of magic has returned to us. We have been chosen. The time has come for us to claim our rightful dominion over the world. Nothing shall stand in our way. Hurrah! Long live Emperor Gestal. Took you long enough. Busy with all the robbing and plundering, I presume? Free Lock! A treasure hunter and trail-worn traveler searching the world over for relics of the past. Lock. I prefer the term treasure hunting. Ha! Semantic nonsense. There's a huge difference. Anyway, is there something you need me to do? There is indeed. I met the girl. Girl? You don't mean... 
The city guard is pursuing her as we speak. The city has the strength to stand up to the Empire, but it won't use. The people are just too stubbornly independent to join an underground resistance group like the Returners. I tried to explain that the Empire was controlling the girl, but they wouldn't even listen. Alright, so you want me to get her out of Narsh. That would be the idea. Make your way to Figaro for the time being. Oh fuck, they're coming! They're coming! There she is! Wonderful. There's a whole bunch of them. Koopo. Hi, Moogles. Moogles? Are you saying you want to help? Koopo. Okay, hurry up. No. We know. Use us to protect Terra from the guards. Would you like an explanation? No, fuck it. Oh boy, Lock? Moglin? Margaret? Moggy? Just go fuck these bitches up immediately. Oh, he is so fast. Oof. That is some heavy damage, actually. This is our A, A team with Mog on it. Fish is up. Oh, we might have some fucking casualties this time. Yep. time. Oh. 
Bog has so much health. Oh my god, how's that fucking... That was a shitload of damage. God damn. Oh, he's fucked up. Ooh, miss. Sorry, bro. Thanks, Boogles. We're in your debt. Grabs her. Uh, where is she? Is she in your fucking bag? The switch order. Eh? You back with us now? You saved me? Save your thanks for the Moogles. Ugh, I can't remember a thing. It's like my mind's trapped in a fog. You lost your memory? Yep. The man said it would come back, eventually. So you've got amnesia. Don't worry, I won't leave your side until your memory returns. I'm not gonna up and abandon someone just because they lost their memory. I'll keep you safe. I promise. not safe here, we'd better hightail it to South, south to Figaro. Figaro! Figaro, Figaro, Figaro! Figaro? Halt. No, oh, it's you. Proceed. We're busting all the damn doors in. Can yeah, I go in here? Go and speak to the king. Yeah. You mean, this young woman is... Who are you? Oh, my apologies. How rude of me to turn my back to a lady on our very first meeting. My boy Edgar, young king of Figaro Castle, imperial ally and champion of the technological revolution. I am Edgar, the King of Figaro. Yeah, surprised that someone like me knows a king? Well, I'll catch you two later. 
So, you're an Imperial soldier, right? Don't worry, we grow and the Empire are allies. Feel free to rest here for as long as you'd like. It's not in my blood to harm a lady. Why are you being so kind to me? Is it because of my abilities? I'll give you three reasons. First of all, your beauty has captivated me. Second, I'm dying to know if I'm your type. I guess your abilities would rank a distant third. What's the matter? Guess my technique's getting a bit rusty. Hmm. I suppose some girls would have felt something from those words, but not me. Welcome! You have a bunch of money. Welcome. Buying all of Edgar's tools for sure. For a bit? Sure, why not? Our king showers his attention on women. Young, old, pretty, or plain, no one is safe. Okay. He's a pimp. Edgar has a twin brother, you know. He was such a nice boy, always thinking of his family. Edgar, what's wrong with Dad? Why is everyone talking about a successor? Are you blind? Haven't you seen how thin his face has become? What do you mean? Edgar! Are you crying? Edgar's twin brother, who traded the throne for his own freedom. Sabin. Ah yes, Sabin. I'm sure he's a fine young man by now. He was just a boy when he left, even smaller than his brother. I often wonder where he is now and what he's doing. Get the fuck out of my way! Fuck! Fuck! Fuck!
Well, how do you like my castle? King Edgar, there's something, someone from the Empire here to see you, sire. Kefka, no doubt. Ah, boy Kefka. Pui, Emperor Gestal's stupid orders. Edgar, you pinhead, why do you have to live out in the middle of a stinking desert? These recon jobs are the pits. Ahem, there's sand on my boots. All gone, sir. <laughs> Pathetic idiots. Sir Kepka, what in the world brings you out of my way? Uh! Fucking bitch slap. Ta! Oh shit! What's up, homie? <laughs> Re! You wouldn't be thinking of invading my kingdom next, would you? We have an alliance. An alliance with this miserable little sand pit? Don't make me laugh. I heard you've been busy down south taking over a country or three. Just what the Empire- what is the Emperor up to? That's none of your concern. Okay. What brings Emperor Gastal's own court mage, Kepka, to my humble castle? A girl of no importance recently escaped from us. We heard she found refuge here. This wouldn't have to do with that witch everyone's been whispering about, would it? Lies. She merely stole something of minor value. Is she here? That's a tough one. There are more girls in here than grains of sand in the desert. A man couldn't possibly keep track of them all. Oh, Edgar, you know, you only stand to lose by trying to hide her from us. Hee hee hee. I truly hope nothing happens to your precious Figaro. I didn't like the sound of that. Where's Terra? Someone has to keep... Take her to her room. I'd love to stay and chat, but the Chancellor and I have some planning to do. Being a king is not all tea and crumpets. Now, if you'll excuse me. Follow me. Why are you walking so slow, bro? Uh, 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 uh. Sorry, I didn't mean to drag you around like this without giving you a chance to rest. I'm... Lock, right? Edgar told me about you. Is it true you're a thief? I'm a treasure hunter. Bitch! Shh. On the surface, Edgar pretends to support the Empire. Truth is, he's collaborating with an underground resistance group called the Returners. I serve as their go-between. The old man you met in Narsh is one of us, too. The Empire. But I'm an Imperial soldier. Not anymore. They were using you, that's all. Things are different now. It's just... I don't know what I should do. Whenever I try to think, it just makes my head hurt even worse. All that matters is that you make your own decisions from now on. Try not to think too hard right now. You'll know what you want to do when the time comes. But how will I know which choice is right? You never do. Huh? What in the...
What's going on? It's the Empire. Kefka, he... What do you think you're doing? Bring me the girl, now! I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh? Then enjoy the barbecue. Hee hee hee! Get her ready. Yes, sire. Had a change of heart? It seems I have no choice. Yeet! Or perhaps I do. Oh my, the brave and noble king abandons his people to save his own skin. How utterly delightful. Jump. Alright, sink her into the sand. Yahoo! Witness the glory of Figaro. Go kill them. Oh, magic tech armor. What's the matter, Edgar? It made you jump like that all of a sudden. D did you just see what I saw? You did, right? Right? Yeah, this kid's really something, huh? Really something? That was magic. Magic! Magic? She used magic? Whisper, 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 whisper. Tara. Your name was Tara, right? What? What exactly was that just now? I'm sorry, I... No, we're the ones who should be apologizing. I didn't mean to make such a big deal out of it. Nor did I. It just surprised me. I mean, I've never actually seen magic before. Where did you... It doesn't matter, does it, Edgar? Tara can use magic, and we can't. That's all there is to it. The fact is, her magic can really help us right now. Thank you, Locke. Thank you, Edgar. Swoon. Bravo, Figaro. Son of a sandworm, you'll pay for this. That was great. Were those bad people? I'm scared. Oh, okay. Wham. Well, Tara, there's someone we'd like you to meet. Like I told you before, we're members of the Returners. Would you be willing to meet our leader? Magic is going to be the key to winning this war. Magic? That Esper reacted to your magical powers. There's got to be a relationship. I don't know any more than you do. These powers just come naturally to me. But no human is born with the powers you have. Forgive me. What should I do? The Empire will be coming after us. They want your powers for their own. 
and if they get them, the world is done for. Tara, you want to understand your own powers, don't you? Then I think you should be with Bannon. He may be able to help you find out more about why you have them. Please, Edgar's right. There's a cave just south of here that leads to South Figaro. Let's head in that direction. Just fucking call a chocobo whenever we want. South Big Girl Cave. King Edgar, where are you headed, sire? Through the cave and eastward to South Big Girl. We'll then make for the Returner headquarters in the north. Return to the castle and pass the word along. Understood, sire. Take care. turtle doing? Fuck. Auto crossbow, so good. Definitely has to be purchased. If you don't buy auto crossbow at the start, Gotta be on drugs. Come steal, what the fuck, you little bitch? Terrible. Oper? This motherfucker survived? What the uh, shit?
Okay, we're actually gonna head back out here because I think you can save in the map. Level eight, okay. Uh, so we are going to cut the episode off here. Uh, we have made it to South Figaro and I'm not sure, I wasn't paying attention to what the town is called, but anyways, in the next episode, we will head into town, figure out what we're doing there. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this episode. Um, it's going to be probably a pretty long series. Uh, I don't remember exactly how long the game is, but it's it's decent length. So we're in for the long haul. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Please make sure to leave a like if you did. Let me know in the comment section and hit subscribe. Turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any future episodes. And as always, guys, I look forward to seeing you in the next one.